Josh, welcome to Old Shot Town. Can you yes. tell us how the move has come about? Um, well, well, the manager obviously called me over the summer. Um, it was pretty early on, and obviously expressed that you would like to sit down and talk. And then um, we kind of just arranged it a couple of weeks after. Um, I came down for just a more normal chat, and obviously to see where where things were at. And then um, just really impressed me. Really said a lot of positive things where where the club uh, is going to go where way things I can go and I think it's a, a really positive step for me in terms of actually um, showing what I can do and where he wants me to play as well. And what, what was it impressed you particularly? Um, just the manner in which obviously I've done this research, um, the club seemed a really good set up, um, how we want to play football um, and just generally the way in which is like approach for next season I had a lot of good things to say and it was like quite um, an in-depth conversation more in depth than I've had with uh, probably other managers. Yeah. And that's a few other players have said something similar that yeah. that it's rare that a manager knows so much about a player mm. before he signs him. Is, is that how it felt with you? Yeah, definitely, definitely. It was, it was definitely a captivating conversation. Um, I thought we kind of built a relation relationship up straight away. Um, and that kind of made me really want to come here, really. You've got good experience already. You're still only a young player, but you've got yeah. good experience. Um, won, the, won League Two with Northampton, played in League One with Swindon. Mm -hmm. Do you think that's, that's a factor in him? That will that'll stand you in good stead here yeah, in, in what is, is always with Gary Waddock going to be a young squad? Yeah, definitely. Um, I think that can only be a positive thing for me. Um, I look forward to it because I like winning, so... If as long as the team's winning and the team's doing well, then I think it'll be enjoyable. And you, you'd already played at this level for Gateshead's mm -hmm. when you were on loan for Derby. That was five years ago, but yeah. is there anything you can take from that period? Yeah, definitely. I think it was one of the most important things that I'd ever probably done in my career because it was my first real, um, real experience of senior football. And I think that was one of the biggest learning curves that I've had, along with Swindon, I think. That kind of really taught me what it's got to take to forge your career, really. You're a versatile defender. You can play right back or centre back. Is that versatility important to you, or do you do you have a preferred position? Yeah, definitely. Um, I think versatility is only a positive thing. Um, of course, obviously, managers see me in different positions. I've had quite a few different managers, but I, I think that's a positive thing. I think you can just have more skills in your position then. Why not? But do you see yourself primarily as a right back or centre back? Or, or no, no, I probably um, I've more did more into a centre back than a right back. But um, I've probably played more games at right back, so it's kind of up to up for discussion. Yeah. For me, as long as I'm playing, I don't mind. That's great. Yeah, and and what what qualities would you say you bring bring to the squad as whichever position you're playing? Um, commitment, physicality. Um, the ability to play out if we want to be playing out from the back um, and just generally an all-round defender. That's good, that's good and yeah. you've, you've said you know, that the club's ambitions are, are high, that was one of the things that brought you here. What, what personal ambitions do you have for the season? Um, promotion really, obviously we don't talk about it a lot but that's the main, the main aim for this club and I don't think we should be anywhere else. Absolutely, that sounds a great way to end. Thank you very much, Josh, and welcome again. Thank you.